Gordo Tron. I knew I had to leave the Big Apple, New York City. I lost a job and was feeling low as hell, so I decided to pack it all up and head out to the Wild West. West Berlin, Germany, that is. My good friend Moses Schneider told me that he'd found me a big old place to live on Wienerstrasse, number 61 if and I remember correct. So, just like my heroes, David Bowie and Iggy Pop, I got myself a 1979 Fender Stratocaster and a few Gentle Giant albums and set up shop. I was hoping to break into the field of rock and roll record producing and set about hustling a bunch of good looking young bands. Now I really appreciate Merlin and Brian Eno. So I set up this little shrine with some cheap 70s style plastic fiber optic I got from Conrad over there on Herman Platz. It was February outside and you know, that means freezing weather over there in West Berlin. Kinda like Christmas everywhere else. Now I like to eat a lot. So for me, the kitchen is a place for celebration. Why, I even decorated my silver refrigerator with all kind of curious George magnets and even a picture of blind faith I'd found in an old newspaper. Hey there, that's me in my green outfit. I like to paint pictures of planets and store my guitar cases in the front room here. That way I can keep an eye on the snowflakes outside and kind of trip out on the people walking up and down Wienerstrasse. Well, there's even a bicycle store right across the street. Oh shit, Gerlitzer Park is my favorite place around here. I rode my bike through the snow, but I forgot my video camera was on. It's so funny because I can hear myself groaning and wheezing as I ride over the snow here. Whoa, this part of the park is where they dropped a big old bomb back in World War II. It left a big crater in it, and in summertime all kind of people picnic and have barbecue in that very spot. That's kind of surreal once you think about it. And this is my favorite part of the park. Somehow on this bridge I can get a certain kind of vibe that's real hard to explain. All I can say is it's kind of pretty. I got a lot of my stuff at this here antique shop. It's called Comfort, but you know, the Germans spell it starting with a K. I don't know why they do that, but they sure have some good stuff there. Ah, back at home, where it's snug and warm. I see Felix and that one alien I got in Japan 
when I was there on tour back in the good old 90s. Have you ever heard of Glenn Cornick or Carol Palmer? Probably not, but they're some of my really big heroes in music. Rock music, that is, like rock and roll. I kind of like the fast, hard drumming, and then there's always the loud guitars, through Marshalls probably. But a good melodic bass line... Excuse me, I have to go to the bathroom. Or Lou, as they call it in London town. Here in Berlin, they simply call it toilet. Catchy, huh? A good melodic bass line, preferably with a few bendy notes tossed in, now that's pretty highly underrated, wouldn't you say? If that guy downstairs smokes one more cigarette, I think I'm going to scream. See, these old Berlin floors have a lot of gaps in them. I'd just go crazy for these Italian typewriters from the 60s. I don't know, but I think my apartment on Wienerstrasse was like a little bit of heaven. Gordo Tronic, from Texas to Berlin. Berlin.